Welcome to the Quixitry workshop. My name is Christoph and in today's video I'm going to show you how I make a, a mallet. So originally my idea was to make a wooden mallet um, to shape sheet metal but um, I've read some articles and I've watched some videos and it seems like weight is an issue. Some of the wooden mallets that you get is not heavy enough and I decided to make, make my own mallet that is heavier and also uh, has different heads that can change um, as, as I need it. So I hope you enjoy this video. You can see I'm, I'm putting this uh, piece of metal in the lathe. Um, all I need to do is I need to tap, drill and tap the hole on the one side. I want to thread it right there. And on the other side, <clears throat> I've got this, uh, this hollow. On the other side is a hollow uh, machine out with a little uh, recess, like an undercut. And I want to pour some lead in, in this side. And on the other side, I'm going to add these uh, plastic machined uh, changeable heads so in future I can if, according to my needs I can make other types of heads and just put them on the same hammer and instead of a wooden handle uh, I'm welding this sheet, uh, this piece of tubing it's a 25 millimeter stainless steel tubing on the, on the back. So um, this is the result. I've got this hammer and one side is lead and uh, it's quite it's much heavier than, than this hammer and it's very difficult to hold it here so I'm actually holding it there when I work but it's quite nice to have it like this and I can change these and I can make my in future I can make other different heads for the hammer on this side so the idea would be that this side will have the crowning side 
and then sometimes uh, it will be a less of a crown this is a very sharp point to stretch the metal quite vigorously this is more like a easy radius and on the other side it's just going to stay flat and that will be to flatten on this side I'll flatten the, the sides again but I can also use this and maybe I'll make one that's flat on this side I already did some experiments So you can get the idea that this is a mud guard, be a mud guard for a wheel. It's small scale, but just to test. And then I so played around and I made this. So very organic shape it was just shaped on the leather so there you have it um, i think time is up for today and there is a hammer and i can change these i can make in future i can make more of these for myself and it's nice and heavy let's change this choose between the, these two curves and for smaller work I've, I've always got this this uh, cheap one that I bought thank you for watching I hope you enjoyed the video I'll see you next week please subscribe and hit that like button cheers